Good evening, I'm Eddie Kolicki. I'm Eric Rosendale. This is Channel 6 News. Three people have been gunned down today in a dispute over a minor fender bender. The killer allegedly crashed into a parked car and shot the three occupants inside. Police have released this sketch of the man. He is said to be six foot two, white, dark haired, of African American descent, and he wears a yellow baseball cap. Investigators report that he may have several explosive materials in his possession. If you see this man, call the fuzz immediately, because he is extremely dangerous. Now we've all experienced the harsh cold of winter, and we've all heard the harmonious chime of a bell, but have you ever heard of winter bells? I know I haven't, but apparently there is a competition going down in the Orisino building today. Now uh, we go to Eric Rosenail, who's on the scene right now. Eric, tell us exactly what these winter bells are. Well, Eddie, Winter Bell is an addictive computer game in which players control a bunny to hop on and off of bells. The objective of the game is to hop on as many bells as you can to get a high score. Back to you, Eddie. Yeah, Winter Bells, that's, that's really cool, but Eric, just one thing. How did you get to the scene so fast? The championship is already well underway, and as you can see, we have many people from all over the world competing in it. It's a very tense crowd here, as one wrong move could send your bunny free falling to the ground, resulting in disqualification from the tournament. Well Eric, that sounds like a really high stakes event. Now let's just hope everybody gets along. Now let's go to Bob Parker with the weather. Ooh, that's hot. Uh, uh, that's quite inappropriate. Uh, thank you Bob Parker. Now let's go to uh, Dan Venture with sports. Baseball? Seriously, what is that? It's not even a sport. Poker's a sport. It takes stamina, skill, and a well-sculpted body. Now let's take a look at some of the highlights from today's World Poker Series. Eric Chin starts things rolling with a beautiful hand. Two aces. Oh look, and here comes the Pelican swing. There's the dismount. Oh, and what a beautiful landing. Look at his footing and the way his arms sway. He's like a seagull caught in a tropical storm off the coast of Hawaii. Played those cards well. Now that takes skill. Eric Chin comes out victorious in his high octane, bone crunching, and adrenaline pumping competition. Back to the station. Thanks, Dan. Now it's time for a brief word from our sponsors. And after the break, traffic and more winter bells. What do we pay you for? You're paid to hold a boom and you. When I was young, I lost my arm in an unfortunate boating accident. Since then, I thought I'd be handicapped for the rest of my life. But that cyber guy gave me this robotic arm. Now I can do normal kid stuff like play baseball or watch TV. Thanks, cyber guy. Dan, how are those highways doing? 401 is moving slowly as usual, however the 407 is closed due to a septic truck rollover. It seems that the truck swerved for some reason, it rolled 20 times, and the muddy brown liquids burst out of the trailer with such force that the fecal matter was sent flying hundreds of meters away from the scene. Crews are working around the clock to clean up the mess, but the effort is strained due to a shortage of toilet paper. It looks as though the 407 will be shut down for another few hours. Back to you, Eddie. Thank you, Dan. Now let's check back with Eric, who is at the Winter Bells Championship. Eric? Excuse me, sir. What are your thoughts on the championship? How are you doing? Well, Doug, my current score is 12 billion, and I'm getting 10,000 points per... Oh! I just lost! You, mate, you distracted me. I will get you, you will pay. Ha ha ha! Eric! Oh my god, look behind you! Look, it's the murderer from the first story! He's got a bomb! Let's go! Oh my god, he's got a bomb! Oh my god! <laughs> Eric, can you hear me? Eric! It appears everyone cleared the room before the bomb went off. Except the computers! They're all dead! They're all dead!